All new Hidalgo County Elections Department hosting an open house allowing the public to take a sneak peek at the newest election machines to hit the market. Action 4's Ashley Custer has those details. Hidalgo County says it's about time to start shopping for some new voting machines. The elections administrator Yvonne Ramon says that the 831 machines currently in use were purchased back in 2005 and they're now reaching the end of their life expectancy. It's why the county is taking a look at the newest and greatest election machines offered by the two vendors approved by the Texas Secretary of State's office, Election System and Software and Heart InterCivic. The newer machines offered by ESNS called Express Vote has a few new features that the current Hidalgo County machines lack. It's all in one. You can have an able-bodied voter vote at this machine. Right behind them could be a handicapped voter and would vote on the same machine. Right now, the county has one machine set aside at poll locations specifically for those with special needs. Heart Inner Civic says Hidalgo County would have one machine that is fully integrated on their Verity Touch system that would have handicap accessible features. Even if a person doesn't have any of those disabilities, if there's no one here that needs those extra features, and it's a busy polling place, anybody can walk up to that same machine and just touch the screen and vote normally. So it's completely integrated into the system. It's not a separate device that sits in the corner that no one uses all day. Both companies say their machines are quite portable, making it easier for the poll workers to be able to set up and break down a poll location. While in the past, allegations of election machine tampering has never been substantiated in Hidalgo County, Action 4 News did ask about safeguards in these the newer machines. ESNS says the Express Vote is a hybrid system, allowing for the use of a digital touchscreen recording system, but it also prints a paper receipt for each voter. Also, with the paper component, it allows for any contested election, you've actually got a paper receipt that you can go back and either hand count or machine count. Verity Touch is a completely digital system, but Trethaway says that's what makes it safe. There are three separate digital records stored on the machines of the ballots that were cast. So even if this whole device got lost or stolen, you could take the 12 machines and extract the vote records from each one of them and they would be equal to what's stored on this little stick and what's stored on the memory of the controller. There are no set prices for each of the models as both companies say they are in the process of getting them certified at the federal level. Ramon says that the county is budgeting and expecting to spend about $4,000 to $4,500 per machine that would be purchased after 2016. In Hidalgo County, Ashley Custer, Action 4 News. And if you didn't have the chance to check out those machines in person, the open house runs until 7 o'clock tonight. You still have some time at the Elections Department Annex 317 North Klausner. That's in Edinburgh.